Hi friends, in this video we are going to see if a current is passing through a pure inductor what will be the voltage across it. So, the statement is like this a 10 millihenry inductor has current I equal to 5 cos 2000 T obtain the voltage VL across it. So, it is a very simple problem. So, let us solve. Inductor value is given as 10 millihenry. So, it is 10 multiplied by 10 raise to minus 3 henry. Current equation I will write ILT because it is a current flowing through inductor equal to 5 cos 2000 T ampere. I cannot compare with the standard equation because of cos. So, I can say this IL is nothing but 5 cos 2000 T which I can convert into a sign like this 5 sin 2000 T plus 90 degree ampere. So, once I compare with I equal to I m sin omega T plus phi, I will get maximum value of current flowing through inductor as 5 ampere and frequency it is angular frequency I get 2000 radian per second and phase angle will be 90 degree. So, that instead of writing equation I can consider this as a phasor 5 at an angle. 90 degree ampere. Now, I know I L to get a V L I should know X L which is nothing but inductive reactance. So, X L is nothing but it is a complex quantity. So, it is a J omega L. J omega is 2000 and L is 10 into 10 raise to minus 3. So, if I solve I will get X L as J 20 ohm. Let us convert that into a phasor. So, it is very simple in a phasor form X L equal to 20 at an angle 90 degree ohm. Now, X L is known I L is known. I can get V L. So, V L is nothing but I m into L because I am considering a maximum value of current multiplied by X L. So, maximum value of current is phi at an angle 90 degree and X L is 20 at an angle 90 degree. So, if I solve I will get V L as 100 at an angle 180 degree. So, I am getting a phasor of this. Let us write an equation. So, in equation form V L will be 100 sin omega t plus 180 degree and we know omega is 2000. So, I can say voltage across inductor is nothing but 100 sin 2000 T plus 180 degree and we know sin 180 plus theta is minus sin theta. So, I can write this V L as minus 100 sin 2000 T volt. This is the required answer. Thank you.